time. It is time. It is time. It is time. It is time. So have to find out where that was coming from. And we got it. So we got rid of that echo. <laughs> I love when a plan comes together. <laughs> well, first of all, it's the wrong time of night day. Yes, indeed. That's right. This is where we are right now. This is Old Sarge 57 Gaming. Welcome. This is about 6 o'clock in the morning, American Truck Simulator time. Just getting here. I hope everybody's okay. I already had my Dunkin' Donuts and my my little um, milk thing, so I'm good to go. This is where we at right now. We at DHL. We're sitting up here at DHL headquarters. We got the DHL truck. Yep. Yep. But that there's Star Wars sitting right there to make it there. Well, let me go ahead and crank it up. Let y'all hear it. That's a smooth engine that we riding in there. Really smooth. on increasing our air pressure so let me get outside and go ahead and take a look around the truck make sure it's roadworthy kick the tires all that good stuff all right let's go ahead and get up here all right let's go ahead and check the headlights we got parking lights hold up let's go parking lights that's good turn signal turn signal it's good bright Oh, there go brakes right there. There we go, regular. I'm gonna walk my nigga around here to this side right here. Running lights are all good on this side. Running lights are running good on, looking good on this side. Let's go ahead and go out to the back. Look at the tires. Uh oh. Wow. So we have to do. We're going to have to make a run. Dang. So. We need to go to the. Where's the. Uh, yeah. Ready to roll. We're going to be going to the truck repair today. We got to go ahead and buy some new tires. So, if you didn't see it. Look at. Look at what I'm running in. I'm running my white walls. Not good. Oh, that goes Harry. What's up, Harry? Yeah. Yeah, we getting ready to go. We're going to get up out of here in a little bit. We got time, so. All right, let's go ahead and get, continue to what we do. Check that. Reverse. All right, we got that so far. Let's hit it here. Hit it here. Okay, cool. Look at what we got up top side. Nope. We do not have domes on the top side, so it's okay. Don't want to need no domes on this. This baby's good to go. Let's see. We good to go. Horn. We good to go. Cool. So. You just waiting for a little bit. Run back inside the office, see what's going on. Yeah, dispatch, this is 57. Um, yeah, let me look at um, what we got going on today. Let me see. I uh, see. Look at the wall, look at the. Um, the cargo miles to see what we got today. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell y'all, we're coming out of Colorado Springs, so this is this is gonna be uh we're gonna be we be running a little bit, so it's gonna be okay today. So we'll be moving around through um Colorado Springs and seeing what we can do from there. We'll be in Colorado in other words, so that's what we're gonna that's what we're gonna be doing our thing at today. 
Well, let's see. Well, we can do a few things. Let's see. We all, whatever happens, we'll be in the process, but we'll make money too. So, yep, we'll make money too. We'll make money too. The unique thing is, let's see, that's 189 miles. So that's, that's a little bit of money. Ooh. Five hundred and six miles for thirty nine thousand. Can't do that one. Ooh, can't do that one either. The reason why I can't do those two is because, ooh, well, I could, but it's gonna take a while to get back there to go get them. Let's see. So what we got here? We can do the light bulbs. Oh, we can just go ahead and do and take this in and do a Nebraska run. All right, we'll go ahead. We'll, we'll, we will take a look at that and see where we are on that. Anyway, so then we'll get that to that in a little bit. Okay, so while I'm looking at this, I want to see if I can. Can I upgrade my truck? upgrades with Scott. No, I don't want to do that. What I want to do with my truck is, is I want to change, I want to fix my white walls. That's what I want to do. But I don't think it's going to let me do it from here. Can we fix it from here? Nope, it's going to tell us to go to the nearest station. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and go to the nearest station, service station, then we can come on back here. You know. We'll see what's going to happen today. Turn left. Turn right. Turn left. Immaculate. Okay, this is all over. It's, okay. it's all over now. Well, yeah, there we go. No problem. We just, had, we just had to take care a little bit. See, is there anything else we need to do? I don't think we have to do anything else. I think everything else is good to go. Yeah, because we're not... We're not going to add... What are we going to add? I don't, I don't think we're going to add the beacon. I think the beacon was going to be an issue. Yeah, because we have to change the cab. And we're not changing the cab top. We're happy where we are. And we're not carrying nothing anyway that we can that we need to change. So let's not let's, let's, let's not mess up a good thing. Cool. Alright, cool, cool, cool. We are cool, cool, cool.
Yeah, buddy. What we got to do is what we got to do. We need to go ahead. We need to go ahead and make that money. So let's go ahead and get ready to get up out of here. Just need to pick up a couple of loads and do what we got to do because we're 34 minutes into this. So let's get ready to go. Okay, we're going to pull it from here. No, we're not going to do that one. How many miles is that one? Nope. <clears throat> What can Brown do for us? What can Brown do for us? Five oh six. Yeah, we could probably get away with that one. No, not that one. <coughs> We're going back. We're going to Kansas. That's about. <coughs> yeah, we can go ahead and pull that one off real quick. Drive safe. Keep right and then continue straight on. Go straight on. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Then turn left. Turn left. Yeah, well, it's going to be one of those. Go straight on. <coughs> yeah, buddy. This is going to be one of those days, that's all. <coughs> As always, just right stuffy, and sore then throat. Turn right. Turn right. Go straight on. Go straight on.
and then turn left. Oh, you thinking about making some ATS videos? Hey, that's cool. Well, I'm on the wrong side to be reeling right now. Turn left. Let's be turning left. Go for that. Good, God, good luck with this. Yeah. Trucking time lapses. That's cool. What well, how how are you gonna do that? What's that gonna be about? Time lapses, time lapses. Tell me this. Okay, we can't, we can't, we can't live like this. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh, cool, yeah. That would do, that would work. straight on. That's cool. Turn right. Maybe I can do one called crash lapses. Since I crash all the time. Turn left. Finally, we are here. That pressure is killing me. I guess the air pressure thing is something that they added later on because I don't ever remember air pressure. My word don't. Yeah, that would be, you know, when you think about it, time lapses, that would be cool. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not ready for that yet. Uh, I got to get to drive this truck better because I guess I could call mine time lapses <coughs> and the way that I drive. Man, I guess, actually, that could be a comedy. 
what not to do. Time lapses. Cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yep. Maybe doing lunch or something like that, taking a break. Mm -hmm. That'd be cool. That would be, that'd be a cool idea. Okay. Well, uh, I decided that it's time for me to embarrass myself, so. Let me embarrass myself. See that DHL though, it's ready. Wow, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I'm, I gotta pay more attention to that flag. I get ready to go into the wrong parking spot too. Yes, indeed. I was getting ready to totally go into the wrong parking spot. I was getting ready to embarrass myself, so. Let's see what's around this corner. Yes, I was almost on the verge of embarrassing myself. Look at that. I can do a lot when I'm not talking. <laughs> hey, look at this. This is the first time I got it this good. This is the first time. Look at this. This is the first time I backed it in. Oh, backed it in this good. This is the first. Hey, it's going to be a good day. It's going to be a good day. It's going to be a good day. First Let's go. That's it. Let's, Let's do this. go. That's right. Let's go. Let's go. That was that was a nice good in and out. Didn't take too long. Yes, indeed. Let's go. Turn left. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Exit now. Wow. Oh. Nice. Keep right and then turn right. Okay, cool. Turn right. Yeah, I'm 
somebody. Yeah, that's a good idea. You got. I haven't started. I haven't started recording while I'm live yet. I do. A, I try to record a little bit when I'm not live, just to practice. I, I try to pack practice little by little because my um I have my um multimedia or we call my recording whatever else you want to call it editing on oh, my editing is on my desk behind me so when I'm live it's one thing but when I'm not live I can all I can transfer well, from OBS, I can go ahead and whatever I'm driving, it automatically goes to the um, the desk. But I can control that because if there's an error or whatever, you know, I can stop and do what I want to do and change it. But when I'm live, I can't do what I want to do. Yo, what's up, man? I will have, hey, <laughs> how's the drive? Well, I just got I just got started driving go about, about a half an hour ago. And this is the first load. Hey, uh, but it's it's going good. You know, it's going good. You know, I got my I got my man Sam. Sam he's on um Sam is on YouTube, so it's cool, so keep right. Yeah. Sam, the guy that you hear me talking to right now, that's that, that's the guy I was telling you about before. That's my pain in the ass. But any type of problems I got with what I'm doing, I can always call him. He has a way of making me learn myself Keep by life. doing, but when I really get stuck, he hooks me up. So this is cool. Let's keep left. Well, better keep left. <laughs> yeah, but it's okay. I'm cool. We're going to be doing to the rig that I have. Jonathan, he's going, he's going, he's, he's going to update my rig. So my rig, I'll be able to edit and do every edit and drive from one place, you know, and do it like that. So hey, so I'll be like that. Then I'll be like you, Sam. I'll be able to do time lapses and all the other stuff. But like I said, like mine's is going to be a comedy. I don't know. Cause mine's is gonna. I'ma call mine's what not to do in American Truck Simulator. Cause you know I, I'm know to flip a truck, crash. Yep. So I'm cool. Jonathan, have you got your American Truck Simulator situated yet? That makes, right now, that makes you, me, and Sam, you know, trying to figure out what time we'll get together and do a convoy. You can put together a convoy stream. But what I want to do is, I want, I, um, I don't know what I want to do. I'm so used to riding with, riding on somebody else's convoy. I don't, I, I don't. I don't know. I could probably make it work. Well, that's the thing we're working on now because. Sam and I was talking about which mods, because we wanted to make sure we had coast to coast, and we were talking about doing uh, this one right here. We were talking about doing the DHL mod, you know, 
That way we don't all have to worry about trying to put different logo colors and all that crazy stuff. You have to have that extra mod for it. So that's um, coast to coast. Keep right and then exit right. Okay, I can do that. But exit right. That way, if you got coast to coast, that there is three mods. Then Keep we got to have right. the engine mod. Um, I don't know. That's the only thing I'm trying to figure out now is what mods should we all have. But then when I was talking to Sam about it, what I said was talking to Sam was we both, he figured out what some good mods, I figured out what some good mods, and then we kind of figure out the numbers or whatever. And then that way we all, we, we both Keep bring... Left. We both bring something to the table when we um con when we do convoy. Ooh. Ooh. Y'all wanna know y'all don't wanna go. Should be nosy. No, can't be nosy. They got that sign up there down there in the way. That's okay. Finding a I, new I route. Need. And then turn left. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, that's not that one. <laughs> it's turn left. Let me tell you what happened yesterday. Yesterday. Turn left. Yesterday it was on the road driving, and the uh, the railroad thing was coming. So you know, the arms wasn't coming down yet. You know. So I we thought so I thought I could go ahead and run past right, it real quick. And then exit right. If the arms are not down, but it's the bells are ringing, don't go. Exit right. <laughs> Do not go. That bad boy made I hit that that invisible wall. I guess because American Truck Simulator has already figured out that people were going to try to run it, or some people was going to say, "Let me see if I can leave my truck stall on the railroad tracks and see what's going to happen." One of those things. I hit that. I hit that. That wall that you can't see. It had my truck flipped over, and I'm talking about it was like pow, and you can see my truck just nose up and flip over. Yeah, I know. But you know, I, I thought I just wanted to see what's going to happen. You know, it's ringing. The arm wasn't coming down. I knew I had enough time, but nope. As soon as the, as soon as the alarm goes off, that little uh, invisible wall goes up. Well, yeah, so yeah. Yep, this is Osage 57 Gaming, Blue Dog Logistics, a global transportation company. We're now part of VTC Team Convoy. So I just want to give a shout out to Team Convoy and Truck Cowboy. I know he's not here yet, but I just want to make sure if anybody's watching, hey, that's what's happening. We're coming to you on five channels. We're coming to you on three Facebooks, one Twitch, and one YouTube. So we're going to be able to enjoy yourself. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, hit that bad boy. Here we go. That's all right. So you go ahead and make sure you enjoy yourself. Somewhere along the line, we're going to be we're going to be doing the transition. Transition. DHL is going to Europe tonight. So we're going to be going from the Americas to Europe tonight. We're probably going to do it probably about after maybe our third... Maybe after the third or fourth load that we do in the Americas, then we wind up going to Europe, and then we're going to be doing some European truck simulator. So there's going to be those people that show up later on. They're going to be kind of confused because they're like, I thought this was American truck simulator. They're not going to notice the transition. And what I should have did was in the description, I should have I should have named this one title this time, the transition, um, ATS to ETS. Like I did the last time. But eh, we'll take notes. And then that way it won't happen again. We ride in the Mac Anthem. Oh, no, I'm sorry. 
Hell no. They got the wrong truck. This is supposed to... Why does it say a Volvo? Is this the Volvo? I thought this was the Mac. Hold on for a minute. Ah, oh, that's right. Okay, cool. Oh, I know what's the matter. Uh, my truckie hasn't changed. My truckie is still set for Europe. So in Europe, I'm going to be driving the Volvo FH. But right now, I'm driving in the Mac Anthem. With uh, I think we got. I think this is a 53 foot trailer. Yep. So, uh oh. So this means that this won't do what it needs to do. Uh oh. Cool. All right. Never mind. All right. All right. What can I do? What can I do? Watch me up this way. Four hours to do 333 miles. So yeah, we can do that. What we gotta do is I gotta fix my trucky overlay. But I know why my trucky overlay is acting the way that it's acting, though. I understand why. Because it's confused. See, the one thing I figured out, well, one thing I found out is that my trucky overlay that I have does not pick up both American Truck Simulator and European Truck Simulator at the same time. Left. It was almost like I would need to. But so so my trucky overlay is stuck in, it's stuck on stupid right now because it's stuck in Europe. Well, what I should have did was I could have cut off. Yeah, well, when I get to a rest stop, I'll try that. I could have probably cut off my turkey and then cut it back on and then tell it which one I wanted to go to. I just got it. Every time, like I said, every time I do something, it's a new learning curve. truck books because if I was in truck books I'd have been pissed right now because I just messed up my delivery because I passed the 81 miles 81 mile an hour threshold so instead of it being a regular delivery it's considered to be a race delivery Truck books won't let me do it either, so. Truck books, you load one or the other. It'd be cool if you could load both, though, and just jump backwards and forwards. Yeah, we got about ooh, 265 miles to go. That's cool. Uh, oh, watch out. Here comes Star Wars. There you go. Come on, go by Star Wars. Look at that, Star Wars. Wow. And a little bit, here comes another Star Wars.
You know the one thing you don't see a lot of in American Truck Simulator? Motorcycles. You don't see no motorcycles. I got a mod for motorcycles, but the thing about it though, why would I need a mod? I don't see. What else you don't see? Um, you don't see motorcycles, you don't see... I guess you see everything else, you just don't see motorcycles. Just get in my way. Come on. But, ooh. but this is man. There is no motorcycles. But that's cool. Well, let me see. Since Jonathan is here. Bells and whistles. I want to know if he. Did you see that, Jonathan? Did you, can you read that? Okay, cool. So that works. Because that's the one that I was telling you that I set up that goes through. Twitch because if I do the other one like I said before it shuts down this screen takes me to takes me to discord then it comes back to this screen so if I do it like that I wind up crashing the truck so when I do the one that you did on the tablet I have to do it at a rest stop or I have to pull over to the side, or I have to be on a straightaway like this, and I have to time it. So. But, ah. Doing all right now, so. And I guess it works better since um, you showed me how to do that overlay on the screen. So, on the stream. So, that works out better. Yeah, we got about 176 miles to go. We had 174. This would have been a good money run for my truck books. But that's okay, I'm gonna make up the difference tomorrow. Tomorrow be Thursday. I'm gonna probably start driving tomorrow at about, ooh, probably about six. Drive to about six to 12. And then I can make up my mileage for all Jeep convoy. Besides that, I don't have no complaints. Everything for me is cool. Um, if you can hear me, it's okay. If the screen's looking okay, if you, if you, however you view it, if it looks cool, good. If you can read my little, whatever you call these things, messages, I, I'm cool.
Oh, uh -oh Team Convoy. Hey, you too, Bubba. Thanks for stopping by. Feeling good in the neighborhood. Everything is working so far just fine. Sixty-four miles to go. So Sam, you're you driving right now?
exit right. Coco, what's up? What's up? What's up? Get ready to turn left. How you doing? Turn left. Woo! See, I did it again, Coco. It's your fault. It's your fault. It's your fault. He made me miss my turn. Uh, made me. Coco made me miss my turn. Be good now. Make me all right. Okay, Coco, you didn't make me miss my turn. I missed my turn trying to do too many things. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, this is like what you call what you can call a Wednesday. This is a Wednesday, like a hump day stream. Just something to make the rest of your day work. We just discovered a recording agency. I can hire more people. Get ready to go to this here Walmart. Wow. Never seen a Walmart. Oh yeah, I've seen that. No, never seen a Walmart like this. I've seen a Target like this. We got a target that looks almost like this. Get ready to turn left. Same old stuff, but just a different day. Welcome to the Wednesday Hump Day. That's all it is. We got the DHL contract, so we're driving for DHL this evening. Get this is also Wednesday, so Wednesday also means transition. So tonight we're going to go in from American Truck Simulator to European Truck Simulator. You have so, arrived at your destination. So you're going to get a you're chance if you've never seen European Truck Simulator. You're going to get a chance to see Europe because we're going to be doing that there this evening. We're going to get at least a couple of loads in here. Let me see. They're going to probably park me right here. I was close. Yeah. Cool. Finish recording, that's good. Is this it? Oh, there's no way in the world is they that nice to me. There's no way, there is no way, it can't be. It cannot be. It can't. Wait a minute. Nope, I knew it was a trick. I knew it was a trick. I knew it was a trick. There was no way that they was going to give me this easy one. Nope, I knew it was not going to be to where they was going to give me this easy one. They gave me this one. Yep, they gave me this one. I don't even think I... I don't even know why I did this... This is not going to work. There's no way in the world. Let me see, can I do it? Nope, I only got the truck in the right angle to be able to pull this one off. Nope, I won't be able to pull it off. So. Yeah, 
see. Sam, that's what I'm talking about as far as time lapse. See, this, this is what you call a time lapse move right here. Okay, we just have to do it this way. Set, set a guy up. Can't believe that. I thought I was gonna have easy parking. Easy parking. You can ask the question right now. Where do you think you're going? You can ask the question right now. Where do you think you're going? Come on, let's go. Yes, indeed. Yeah, buddy. Like always, if, if I'm not talking to you, it's not because I'm ignoring you. It's just that it's hard to chew bubble gum and drive at the same time. Take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I will take it. I will. Who? Yes, indeed. I'll take it. Cause no matter what happens, I gotta keep making that money. Okay, so we up in Kansas now. So the problem is that while we in Kansas, oh wait a minute, I got something I need to do. Be. I'm still here with you. I got to do this real quick while I'm thinking about it. It's picking me up, but it's not picking me up where it needs to pick me up at. So, what we have to do is we have to, we have to cut it off. And make it pick it up. Hopefully it does. So when we go back, when we hit it, we come back. Nope, it did not do it. Hmm. 
Okay, so hold on. We we almost done. We almost done. Don't don't go nowhere yet. Don't go nowhere yet. We're gonna have to exit all the way out. Now we exit all the way out. We come over here. We shrink this one, and we let it crank itself up again, and let it find the one that we needed to find. happens it happens and it don't it don't okay let's go ahead and pick up some cargo what do we want to pick up let me see we can keep going east no we can't keep going east because i think we're going to be i think we're going to fly out of colorado this time so i think that's what we're going to fly out of either colorado or we're going to go out of um cheyenne so let's see Went back to Flagstaff, Arizona. Yeah. Let's let's get out of that business real quick. Let's go back. See what you got now. Still got the same thing. Oh, sweat. So you're in Colorado? Cool. That is so cool. I've been to Colorado once. My son was stationed at Fort Carson, Colorado. And I had to pick up my daughter. Check this out. I picked up my daughter and my granddaughter in Washington State because my son-in-law is in the Navy. And he was getting ready to deploy. So my daughter was ready to come home. Now, remember this. I live in Florida. So I had to go pick up my daughter. I flew in to Washington State. My daughter wanted to bring her truck. So I flew into Washington State, picked up her and my granddaughter. My granddaughter at that time was probably maybe about a year old. And we drove from Colorado, I mean from Washington State to Florida. But, but in between, we wanted to surprise my son for his birthday. So we drove to Fort Carson, Colorado. Also for my birthday, well my birthday month. We went to Mount Rushmore. Yeah, so when you yeah you, you see yeah you trekking with me yep. So if you looking at the map that I'm pulling around now, you figure where. We was up here, and we had to we made the run. Okay, I've seen so much of this, and this and this and this. Then we got here, came down to New Mexico, came across the ten, um, I-10 corridor, all the way across to Florida, they hit the I-95 corridor, going south, to get to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Yeah. So let me see what we're going to do now. We need to go back west, so let's see what they are. Oh, that might be just a ticket. Yep. That'll take us right back to Collins. Yep. That'll take us right back into Fort Collins. Yep. That will keep us around our base. Yeah, that'll work. Let's go back to Fort. We're going to do that. Let's go. Let's go. Yep, so yeah, we can do that one right there. Yes, indeed. We can do that one. Drive safe. I will. Let me see if this works now.
Yeah, so that was a long ride there. That was long. Turn right. But get ready to turn right. Yep. We went to Mount Rushmore and the, uh, you're talking right. about if you want to talk about ah uh, the ah uh, of Mount Rushmore. Oh buddy. You know, when you see uh, the, the, all the big words that you learned in school, it is, it was there. And we sat in them, like what they do is they have like a th amphitheater. You sit down right in front of it while they're talking all about it. And uh, what happened was the, ready to turn right. the guy that was, um, that, well, whatever you want to call him, the, the, the carver, the sculptor guy, he still had family turn members, right. his daughters. His daughters were still there because they lived on site the whole time, and Get their daughters were still right. there trying to um. Oh, it's up front. They were still there working on the legacy because they're Turn also right. doing um. I think it's Crazy Horse. This is where it ends. Oh, thank you very much. But I think they were um, working on Crazy Horse. But that was so cool. You know, you get this. They show you the models of the models that he did, and the whole. Uh, it's just, uh, it's just a lot of words to try to talk about something that looks so, so, so cool. Yep, it was. You know, when they talk about the magnificence and all that stuff. Oh man. And you get a chance to go into the head, or at least on the top of the head. We didn't, I didn't get a chance to go because my granddaughter, she decided that she was going to get sick at that time. She was doing so well on the road, but I had her in my arms, and she decided she wanted to upchuck, and she didn't do a, fr she didn't upchuck when she was facing away from me. She waited until I picked her up and had her on my shoulder, and she upchucked on my shoulder. You could see it running down my back, the front of my shirt, so hey. You had to go back to the car, get me another shirt. We call that we call that a day. We wasn't going. I wasn't going to mess with no more. Cause I was thinking that she wasn't feeling well. So that's right. But that was my grandbaby Annabelle. Um, but yeah, Colorado is cool. I like I liked Colorado. Some new way of parking in there. Let's see. Maybe I'm, I'm still gonna put it in the box, I think. I'm still trying to put it in the box. Here we go. Okay, see. First, you get a couple of good ones in, and then all of a sudden, they turn on you. I got to say, maybe this may be. Oh, you done editing? You're going to drive some? Maybe, 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 maybe Coco was good luck. You know, I've been hitting, the, I didn't hit the green a couple of times now, so maybe Coco showing up is um, bringing me some good luck. It's not taking me that long to park. Yeah, so it's loads loaded. We get ready to go. Time to hit the road. We on our way back to her home state. We on our way back to Colorado. So. We'll see. But then again, I, I could probably cut up my rod advisor. And Coco, you can tell me how to get home. You know. Okay, turn left. Okay. Turn left. Turn left. There we go. Yeah. Get ready to turn right. Oh, Starbucks. Turn right. Get 
get ready to turn right. Turn right. So Coco, uh, maybe not. Well, we know you live in Colorado. We don't need to know no more nuts you want to tell. But um, have you ever been there, been to Fort Carson? Or um, Keep right and then exit matter of right. fact, not that. Have you ever been to the Coors Beer, Beer Brewery? Exit right. Wow, 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 wow. See, I told you. It's not your fault, Coco, I'm crashing. It's my fault, because I cannot talk and drive. This is the second time I almost missed my turn, so hey, it's all my Keep fault. Left. I take it back and I apologize. Okay, good, we go good. So we are 70 West. So Sam, you gonna drive you gonna drive or you gonna drive yours? I figured you're gonna be driving your um driving your truck. Keep doing what you're doing like we did the last time. While you was driving, I was driving, we just talking old while each other was driving. Because you said you was finished editing, so I thought about we well my wife and I we thought about as for my retirement at one time or another we thought about retiring in Colorado we did but then I got a I, I kind of I like I like Flagstaff Arizona and I just I can't put my finger on it my wife says it's because it's almost like being a hippie in Flagstaff everything in Flagstaff Arizona is so laid back you know the people there are just laid back so cool now yeah you know what that now, now, now yeah you're right that makes that's a good job that's a good idea you know just doing different loads quick jobs yeah Yeah, and the other thing about quick loads, you know, is that you don't have to really go through the drawer trying to really figure it out. And I'll just, like you said, get your quick loads for, you know, record all your quick loads and then do, get your editing. Yeah, that's, that'll work. I guess I need to put my lights on. There we go. This is going on 2 o'clock in the morning on a 
Sunday, ATS time. So I think I'm going to probably do, let me see, we had, yeah, we had one hour and 40 minutes into the stream. So maybe at, depending on where the load is, maybe I'll do the first transition. Because I'm, I'm already going to be in Colorado. So we'll see. Maybe I'll probably do a, maybe a two loads that doesn't take me that far out. And then have one load bring me back in. Yeah, I can do that. I just have to put together the load that's going to take me to. It's got to be able to take me to the airport. That there is the issue. Okay, so when I go to YouTube, right, I just look you up as Sam XLT, right? So in the search engine, I put in Sam XLT, and I should be able to find you. So I can see the video. Cool. Okay. Making my business to do that when I get through with this. The guy that was on earlier with us, Jonathan, he's um why he's that's what he majored in when he was in college, computers and all that other stuff. He's man, he's he's a whiz at all this stuff. Probably just like you. So he's the one that's teaching me and showing me, and his plans were for me to get the driving in you know and then after I get the driving in and feel a little bit comfortable with that then to start recording and then start to edit but what do you use for editing software because I use what is called Monte Montevea Monte, 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 anyway it's Mont, Montevea something like that And I did, I think you saw that pilot that I did, my intro, my old intro. My old intro, I, I did that one. I, I kind of played around and edited with that. That's when I had my, um, that's before I changed to the new company colors. Yep, we got about 312 miles to go. This is still Old Sarge 57 Gaming, Blue Dog Logistics, a global transportation company. Now riding under the colors of Team Convoy. Now you see the medallion and the spinning and the spinning and the spinning. That's who we ride with now, so be attuned to Team Convoy. And if you ever stop time, stop by with Team Convoy, somebody from Team Convoy is streaming. Hey, this day I tell me old Sarge 57 said hi.
So if we do this right in the a.m., sometime during the time of the a.m., depending on what time I get to Fort Collins, we could be trying to work on transition one in the first half of this here stream. Two hundred and forty-eight miles. So yeah, we're doing real good, or rather well, or okay. I don't know. Later for it, I like saying real good. We're doing real good. That's the other thing I like. I like when I pick my cargo, and it's a, it's more or less a straight run for a little while. All those curves and all that other stuff, eh, they're fun, but sometimes. today too. Oh man. I'm trying not to play any type of music because I hope the transition and everything goes well and I don't want nothing to be muted or nothing like that or anything happens. I want this one to be a good transition if it, if, if it happens. This is only the second one though so this is the second time I'm trying this. It's going to be ooh. one hour and 48 minutes into the stream. If you're still here, thank you very much. If you left, I'll see you. Don't want to be here. Oh, so hey, what do you think of my little chat with them that we put down, I uh, put there on the bottom left hand corner? Oh, Coco, I know you're still here. Oh, so what do y'all think of that little chat with them? The reason why I put that chat with them there because I didn't know I could do that either. Um, but Jonathan, the guy that was on the show, me, because somebody, well, my wife was on the other day and she was talking up a storm. She is, she's a joke a minute when she wanted me. But everybody was missing the jokes because I'm on five channels. So Twitch couldn't see Facebook and Facebook couldn't see Twitch. And nobody could see Sam. So I didn't know that you can put something like that on the screen. No, maybe I did because I saw it somewhere. But I got it. Um, and I, it was all because of Restream. When you do this, you get this on Restream. You, stream, um, you go to the browser on the OBS, you go to Restream, and Restream gives you whatever code, whatever, whatever code it was, how we did that. I only had it again. Oh, no, you put the URL in the browser, and the browser will pull up the Restream chat. I didn't know that. I didn't know that Restream do all that. I just thought the Restream just had... You could just stream on five channels. I didn't know that you could do all this other crazy stuff that Restream will allow you to do. I, Keep you know, left. Every time I turn around, I'm learning about plugins and apps and um, 
all kind of other stuff. It was like OBS. I didn't know that OBS, OBS can do, um, what do you call that one? Something elements. SE, Steam elements, Stream elements. And the other one, I didn't know that. i tell you, I, I didn't have a clue. I didn't understand that OBS and Discord can work together. I, I'm telling you, I'm new to the game. You know, all I wanted to do was, you know how, okay, I, I'll give you the best example. You know how you have your cell phone and you go to Messenger, well, if you have Messenger or on your phone, or if you have the app on your phone where it says, show your screen, that's what I thought streaming was. Wow. That's what I thought streaming was. I thought streaming was something like that. You know, you just log on somewhere, hit a button, and show your screen. screen, screen. And I know you can still do that in Facebook, but I didn't know you had to do all this other stuff for streaming, like what I'm doing right now. And I got all this here. I got a Steam Deck in front of me. Or, no, I'm starting Steam. A Stream Deck in front of me. A, a media thing. I got a tablet on one side, I got a tablet on the other side because my three monitor screens are my truck screens, so I can't see what y'all guys are talking about. I, before when I was streaming, I couldn't even see what y'all was talking about. I just drove. You know. Now I can see what you're talking about, so it's cool. What's that three? Cool. You know, I'm learning that I got to take baby steps in what I'm doing because I have um, an adult, what do you call it? Adult ADHD. I think you call it that. And my wife says that because my kids, when they were growing up, my son, he had it too. And I'm the same. I have it as far as an adult. My focus, I'm doing one thing, and then all of a sudden, if you say squirrel, I will look for the squirrel and crash the truck. You know, I'm in, I am just that much into what I do, you know, while maintaining my focus. You know, that's why when, I, when we're streaming, I'm going to have to do things like, uh, what's her name, Shy? Shy on her. <laughs> Shy on her. Her name is in the marquee. Shy on Keep her flat. stream. She has a thing on her stream saying, "If I'm not if something about, I'm, if I'm not paying attention to you, I don't meet the dumbass is doing something else. So if you say something, whatever, uh, exclamation chat, and then I'll I'll get back with you. So hey, I know I'm, I'm at least I'm glad I'm not the only one. So it's just." You get to be so immersed in what you're doing and having so much fun with it that everything else is going on. Unless you had it, and that's what I'm working on now. Unless I had the chat as an overlay on my driving screen, Keep left. it'd be a different story. And I tried it, and I can do it with Trucky. The only thing with Truck, Wolf Truck does, well, the only thing, wow, we almost home. The only thing that happens with truck is it, it turns the screen dark and then the overlay is there. So it's a dark um, thing. Now, it might be a Keep different way right. to do it. And I don't know. What did you say? You should go right. Are you sure you want me to go right? You sure you want me to go right? Okay, we're going right. Do you want me to keep right? Keep right. Fort Collins, here we come. But, so, I'm going to, every time I, every time I get a chance to learn something, like you, like y'all see, when I first started, I didn't have a marquee. Now I got the little marquee or the ticker, so I'm good. Now I got the medallion, I know how to put the medallion. And now I got the blank, the black overlay. So, the fun part of this is I'm getting a chance to, learn it little by little as I go and that's the fun part and it's really cool so that's that um I still haven't figured out my time zone but I think my time zone is going to be from 
nine. I think it's going to be from about nine to one. I think I'm going to fall into that time zone with my, when I stream. At least for right now, because when I get off work, I got off work today. I came in. I set up the stream. The stream I set up everything that I was going to do. Then I went in the room and took a shower and took a snack. And I went to sleep. I had my wife. I told my wife, just wake me up at 818. You know, so I think that's, I think I'm going to stay on this timeline. Except for the weekends. The weekends, I'm just going to go hog crazy and just stream a lot. You know, or stream for as long as they let me until they tell me to stop. But I think... It's six hours at a time. I think I read something about six hours. Um, they do it's six hours, and then boom, you go to the next one or something. I don't know what they said, but there was something about six hours. I don't know. I have a clue. Keep left. But uh, we got 32 miles to go. But that was, that's the cool part, so. Buddy. Oh, we're going to the two-hour mark, so we need to go ahead and f figure it out. Oh, man, come on. Come on, come on. There's the way station here. Yeah, that's right. Here. Okay, let's find a new route. Ready to turn right. Yeah. Oh, nope, we're going to Home Depot. Turn right. We're going to Home Depot. Oh, Kentucky Fried Chicken, check that out. Boy, I love those mods. Those mods make all this stuff feel more real than ever. Yeah. Here we are, safe and sound. <laughs> See what we're gonna do with this. Okay, well, they're gonna probably try to put me back here somewhere. So let's see first. Oh yeah. So yeah, we can try it. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work.
tell me to use my mirrors, I'm not gonna pay you no attention. The new Volvos and Range Rovers, they got 360 cameras. So why can't I have a 360 camera on my truck? So don't, don't be that person. No, it's okay, you can be that person. Sometimes you need that type of person on your shoulders once in a while. You know, something that you can practice ignoring. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Let's do it. Let's get back to it. Come on. Timing is everything. Timing is everything. And I just almost had the timing down pat. That's okay, come on. Timing is everything. Here we go. A little bit more in the corner. Now we go this way. Now we should be able to get that trailer almost in the middle corner. There we go. Oh, yeah. I hear that. So, we did good. We did good here. Come on. So, let me see how we can plan this. Current office. These are out of office. This is to Nebraska. Nebraska. Okay, so if it goes to Nebraska, I can always come back to it. If it goes to Nebraska, what's that place called? I just saw it. Yeah. What does that one have coming back this way? This is coming back to Colorado, Sp Colorado Springs. Okay, so wait a minute. We need something that's coming back to Anton. Okay, Anton. So what do I have coming back to Anton? Wow, that's a lot of stuff. What do we have for coming back? So this one would go to Anton. So when I come back, this one might still be here. This is the one that we can use to fly out. bring this one to DHL. Why do I keep typing in there? It's call 3M. So, what do we have coming in? Let's go to the low end. DHL is in Colorado Springs. Anyway. Okay, cool. I got a plan. That's what we're going to do. We're going to take this run. We're 
we'll take this run and leave outside. And then we'll come back. So we'll take this run. Where's that run I saw? We're going to work on trying to get back here to Colorado Springs. Where we can load the package of food. We have to be on the outside of Colorado Springs. Oh, I, I'm real sorry if y'all hear me in the background <laughs> talking to myself. I'm trying to put something together, but like I always said, uh, my streams is going to be different. So it's just me talking like y'all, we all talking together. And so, hey, it's just the way it is. Hey, I just want to, okay, you got to get my transition together. Oh, no. I know I got it. I know I, I know it's here somewhere. Fort Collins can go to I can get Fort Collins to go to no I think I just lost it when I went to date nope Fort Collins can go to Denver Denver has the plane but Denver has the airport But the question in Denver is, Denver doesn't have a 3 H a 3, it has a DHL, 3D, 3M. See, there is no 3M. Not in Denver. Okay, here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. Sorry. I, t I told y'all the number one rule. And here it is, I broke it. I gave y'all the number one rule, and then I turned around and broke it. Okay, we got 11 hours. Always remember this. Offer expires. If it takes you longer than the amount of time for the offer to expire... It will not be there when you get there. So then you'll be sitting at UPS or sitting at DFA with no loads. So I just want to make sure we remember that. Let's Ready to roll. Okay, we're good now. All right. I can tell you, no matter what, I love the sound of this truck. Um, I truly love the sound of this truck. 
Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Turn left. I'm most definitely going to check it out. Keep right and then turn right. Go straight on. Oh yeah, so. Get ready to turn left. Cool. I'll take a look at it. Turn left. I gotta just put this here and figure out how I'm going to do it. I just have to pause and do it. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. It's all over now.
Time to hit the road. Yeah, that there's the FA, um, Dairy Farms of America. You'll see that one again tomorrow. Tomorrow, when I stream tomorrow, we're going to be doing livestock. So we'll be transferring chickens and pigs and hogs tomorrow. Turn right. We're going to be using the Wilson Livestock Trailer. So that's going to be an interesting one tomorrow. So it's going to be cool. So we'll be doing livestock. And we may be doing um, government contract because there's a lot of military vehicles. So we're going to probably do both of those. Go straight on. It had an accident there, so let's keep going. transition so I want to try to get that done in this hour keep left and then turn ah! turn left Yes, indeed. Oh, yeah, that was so much fun. I told you, Sam, my, hey, when I learn how to do that time lapse, my time lapse is going to be stuff that you shouldn't do. So we can do this here load off and get done. Come on. Get ready to turn right. Come on, let's go. Oh, it was that Kentucky Fried Chicken place again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Turn right. Yeah, come on, come on. We did a pickup from here earlier. No, we did a drop off here. Ready to turn left. Come on, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Look at the light is green. Come on. Turn come left. On. Keep right and then exit right. Okay, good. We'll make it. We're going to do it. We'll do it. We're exit do it. right.
<laughs> yeah, you're right. Maybe I'll just name mine. Uh oh. <laughs> or just laugh. <laughs> That's okay. Y'all can agree. I agree too. I'm cool. Hey, look. I realize that sometimes I get to be so into this that I don't even pay attention after time. Like right now, my my cat, my cat is climbing up on my leg and she, she wants to be in my lap and watch me do this and then she'll start playing with the steering wheel so, hey, I'll take my hand off the steering wheel I tell that it's in your hands you figure it's in your paws you figure it out I don't know what you're going to do with it you know but hey oh <laughs> that's cold blooded why I shouldn't be allowed to drive. Okay, cool. All right. All right. Or I could just call it don't do this at home. I don't have a CDL. Now, believe it or not, I have a CDL because what I do, what I used to do about, about what, 10 years ago, I used to be an activity, I used to do activity bus driving for my cadets because when I was at my school, I had 200 cadets. So whenever we wanted to go someplace, if I needed to take cadets to a drill meet or marksmanship meet or anything like that, I always had to, we always had to fundraise to pay for the bus. So I went and got my little CDL and my activity bus driver's license. So I can drive a bus now. Okay. Well, at least I think I can drive a bus. So yeah, I got my little CDL. You know, I try to keep it relevant. Why CDLs are not needed for everybody. <laughs> oh, yeah, y'all, okay. Why well, shouldn't have a CDL? Okay. That's all right. Cool. Ah, right, whatever it is, I got 32 miles to get to where we got to go. We'll try to get this here transition done. I'm trying to get it done before it gets dark. Come on. Hey, 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 
Welcome to Osage 57 Gaming. This here is Blue Dog Logistics, a global transportation company. Also associated with Team Convoy. So if you're going to stay a while, sit back. Go get you something. Get you a snack or something. Sit back and check it out. I can tell you right now, it's going to be funny. <laughs> It's going to be funny. Now, if you're looking for some serious driving, uh, you need to go ahead and you need to go get, uh, I don't know where you're going to go. But if you just want to be able to smile, crack a joke, and listen to what's going on, hey, you are welcome to stay. Make sure you hit that follow, that like, or that share, depending on where you're coming from. You're being, you're being cast in five different channels, so you're going to see some people here from YouTube. You're going to see some from Facebook. And you're going to see him here on. from Twitch if you're coming from Twitch. So just go ahead and make sure you go ahead and have a seat. Go ahead and enjoy yourself. Just hang out. But make sure you hit that follow. That way you can get your name up there in that marquee. Because the one thing that the marquee does is everybody that comes here now is know they can go look at somebody else and see what they're doing just because of that marquee. So that marquee is going, oh, what's that? Oh, that's the wrong turn. Keep left. And then turn left. Oh, we're going to Walmart. No, we're not, we're not going to turn Walmart. left. You know, I think that that plane and that, you know, I'm telling you, these graphics are so cool. Yeah, so yeah. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Take the first exit. Exit we've been, now. We've been here before. Get ready to turn right. Yeah, we just we just left this place. UPS. Turn right. What can Brown do for you? I don't know. Finally, we are here. Okay, so we do that. Oh, I'm sorry. You know we got to we got to do this first. We're gonna do this way first. I want to see it. I'm hoping we can do it from here. Come on, give me one. Give me one. Come on, give it to us here. No, I can't do it from here. Come on, we got to find it. Give me one, give me one, give me one. Give me one, give me one. Give me one. Come on, give it to me from here now. Do I have one? We got a DHL, but ooh, that's too far. Do we have one? Nope. No, we don't have one. Come on. We have one? No. Pueblo, come on, give me one. We need one. We need one. Wait a minute, let's do it this way. ABQ. If you type in ABQ, any place where they got um, the airports at, usually, these are all airports. Anywhere they got airports at, these are all airports. These would have actually been called FedEx buildings. So, that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm trying to get us to... Trying to get us to a FedEx building for a Colorado transition. That's the only thing about doing this. They're just not always on time. So, if you can't get AB, ABQ, you can get Ant A A N T O N, and that is the plane. <laughs> so let's see what we got. I know there wasn't no, wait a minute. Whoa. Wait a minute. We get to deliver to the, okay. We can, we can do this. We can do this one. This one we should be able to do. It's going to get us to that airport, to that plane. Yeah, we can. We'll, we'll we will fake the transition. Yeah, we can do this one. Let's get up out of here. Let's do this. Yeah, let's do 
let's do you right. Let's do this. We got to get up out of here. Well, we still got... Okay, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. We still got enough daylight. Where we have to go is not that far. Come on. Go left. Turn left. In the roundabout. Take the first exit. Was it the second exit? At the roundabout, oh. take the first exit. <laughs> Oh, look at this here! Oh. <laughs> Exit now. Ah. I I I can't I messed up traveling in the roundabout. Okay, we're gonna go ahead to this what's this, Walmart? Yeah, we're gonna go to this here Walmart and pick up some water. And we're gonna have arrived at your destination. Your rap guide no, is now finished. finished. Okay, cool. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. This is <laughs> this is it. This is it. This is it. No. Okay, come on. Just get me there because I'm not gonna try to park today. Come on, where you at? Come on. Let's see. Back there, are you? Yeah, you are. You back there? Yep, it's, it's back there somewhere. There we go. Yeah, it's back there. As we get close, ping me now. Give me the ping. Ah! There is a, I think it's like a, um, in the steering wheel, it's like a little slight under and over turn because you're turning and sometimes it just doesn't react enough quickly enough what <laughs> you don't trust me with my roundabout skills in Europe you wait till you see my skills in Europe you wait you wait you're right about the roundabout skills <laughs> in, in Europe they, they probably don't even want me in Europe because in Europe I'm known to knock down signs <laughs> drive safe I am known to knock down signs. Never mind. I'll find a new route. Oh, stop crying. We'll be going. We're going to make it. Come on. We got two hours and a half to make it. We'll be we'll be done quick. What time is it? It's 11.22. It'll still be daylight. We'll be just in time to catch the flight. Turn right. Yeah, we'll be just in time to catch the flight. Just in time. At the roundabout, take the first exit. I got the, I got it right this time. <laughs> exit now. <laughs> Keep right, and then turn right. Yeah, well, anyway, then we have rather just got a call for dispatch. Turn dispatch right. wants us to take it directly to the runway, so there is no problem. We're gonna be okay. So we don't have to worry about it. It's going to go straight to the runway, and they're going to take it straight off the truck, and they're going to load it. I guess the water is much needed somewhere in Europe, so. I don't know. We'll be all right. We'll figure it out, so. Oh, do you know that they have, um, they have a mod for COVID supplies? Think about that. When COVID was out, well, I'm talking about when it was out, even while COVID is out now, there was a mod that where everything that you was picking up as cargo was PPE. Yep. Yep. 
Yeah, that was cool. Time to turn over no truck. Keep left. We got about 105 miles to go. Yeah, we'll be okay. Ah, oh, man. I still find the city Keep graphics. Left. Ooh, oh, look, look. The Olympic um, Training Center. Training center. What did I just do? Oh, okay. That's okay, cool. No more button pushes. No more button pushes. We're not gonna push no more buttons. Yeah, the world of truck events, cool. You know, I did the Montana event where you go to all the cities, well, at least nine of the 12 cities, and you're supposed, I got the achievement, you're supposed to get something else. I think it's somewhere in my state. I've done, have you done a lot of those achievements? I think I've done 40 out of the 80 achievements. Oh, we almost hit that guardrail. Makes sense. See, that's the stuff that we, I got to start doing, and um, I, I'm working on starting to put together a script. But at the same time, when I put this, together the script, then if I'm going to be in the character, I guess I have to work on being in the character the whole time. So there's going to be times when I'm going to stream in character of Old Sarge 57, and then there's going to be times when, like we're talking now, we're going to talk now. But that's the reason why I want to build. I want to build my followers because then I can have a, I can have a dispatch. I can have one one of the followers get to have them be the one or one of the moderators, however you want to call it. Wind up being the dispatch. So we make the call, dispatch what you got for me, and then what they'll do is tell me which one I want to. When I pull it up, they'll be even though I'm looking at it, they're going to be the one calling out which delivery I'm going to do. Wow. Keep right. And then exit right. Wow. Wow. Okay, we got this. Exit right. Keep right. Yeah. But yeah, you right. And then um if you get what I want to do is, if I could, it would be cool, if we can turn American Truck Simulator into a role play. Keep left. When, like, when when we come on, we got other people that are, um, they could be still driving, but part of their character, like, maybe one week, I, I want to be in the gun, I'll be the voice of dispatch. You know, so when you call in, you know, okay, or breaking down when we're doing tolls or whatever 
and you get a call that we got to pick up a toe at such and such, such and such. You know, not full role play like all the rest of them, but just stuff added thing. Just like you just said, um, you know, it got the right. call, look. And then turn right. What? Oh, the next one. But like you just said, you know, um, dispatch gave us a call. We need to go pick up this here water from Walmart. Turn and we right. got to deliver it to Denver because, you know, it's going to be a plane taking off to such and such country because, um, just like you said, because of the flood and everything else. Or what we do is come up with the same storyline and then let the bot show that storyline in the chat. So when it comes in and just says welcome, then the next one says today's episode is or the um, BLL is doing BDL and BLL is doing this type of run today. See, we got the DHL Excellent. sign right, right there. So this here works out for us. See? I didn't Turn know I changed right that many. And then keep left. Yeah, that DHL sign would have said FedEx. Keep left and then turn left. Wow. Turn left. And then I changed all the trucks over there. Well, I forgot what company they had. There was a FedEx, too. The only thing I couldn't do, the only thing that I still haven't figured out is left. how to change that building. Keep left. Keep we got left. the DHL sign. But I still haven't figured out how to change that FedEx sign on that building. That's the only Keep thing I haven't right figured out yet. And then turn right. I can change everything else turn except for that right. FedEx.
So one of the things I gotta do is I gotta figure out how to get this part a little bit better. Yeah, buddy, welcome to Europe. We, right now, we're in Stuttgart, Germany right now. Okay, get ready to get up there. See, we already parked at the DHL here in Europe, so hey, we're going to be good to go. What we got to do now is we got to go pick up that load that just landed at um, the Air France um, Europe Airport. So we got to go pick that up. We already checked out the truck, so the truck has already been checked out. Low air pressure is beating me to death. Oh, it's beating us to death. But what am I doing? I didn't have to hit that button. Yeah, I could. Um, yeah, I could. I, I'll take a look at it. Hey, welcome aboard. This is uh, we having a good time. So excuse this. Uh, this is Old Sarge Fifty Seven Gaming. This is Blue Dog Logistics um, Transportation Global. Um, if you just arrived, you missed the transition. We did a transition from. American Truck Simulator to European Truck Simulator, so that's what we did just now. So we did a nice little transition to get us there. But hey, you're welcome. Go ahead and take a seat, have a enjoy the ride. We're going to be in Europe for just a little while, and then we're going to be transitioning back to American Truck Simulator. One of the reasons why we did this here is to try different things in the stream, where you're not only just seeing American Truck Simulator, but ways that you can go back to Europe and go back to America, because SES is not going to do it. Well, they may do it in the near future, but enough people ask about it. But how do you put something together like that in the stream? And if you were here, you saw the transition, and we're now sitting in Stuttgart, Germany right now. And when we get through, we'll probably wind up back in Denver, Colorado when we finish. So make sure while you're here, give us a like, give us a follow, give us a share. If not, give us a subscribe. Right now, we're on five channels. We're on three Facebook channels. 
we are on one Twitch channel and we're on one YouTube channel. When I say we, I mean us because we're all part of the dog pound. So once again, welcome. Make sure you go ahead and hit that follow. Listen, the one thing about the follow is you follow me, I follow you. If you don't like what we're doing the second or third time you come back, you can always unfollow. But at least give us the opportunity where you can go ahead and follow along and see what we're doing and everything else. Cool. Yep. Cool. So hey, go ahead just make sure. Let's have a seat. If you don't want to talk, it's okay. Because I talk enough for everybody. We just had to get the air pressure up because every time I jump into my truck, it's that. Right now, we're in a Volvo FH. Okay. I love my Volvo trucks when I'm over here in Europe, so. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get ready to get up out of here. Oh, here we go. Turn right. Get my tablet ready. Keep left. Keep left. Okay. If this tablet comes on, I can go ahead and go to YouTube and look at your video. So let's hope that she remembered to keep it plugged in for me. Uh -oh. Okay. Let me get to a, a rest stop. The only thing that I need to um, figure out, well, she said keep what? Okay. The only thing that I truly need to figure out is that I have to figure out the transition. There's too many um, changes in the video, but I had to splice, cut up the video a lot. So that's the reason why it looks the way it is. Because the video is actually longer when we all put it together. So, so then... We, I had to pick and choose what I wanted. See how we got that DHL sign here? Yeah. And we're getting ready to pull into the, our DHL at the airport. It's all over now. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I was saying to you when we was talking about it before, why DHL is the, the better one of... FedEx and the rest of them because DHL is in both places so if we decide that when we're doing American Truck Simulator or we decide one day we want to do European Truck Simulator we don't have to worry about trying to come up with all these different colors and different patterns and all these different skins you know just for this here part yeah we just do this right here and then all I do is pull in here pull up a load but for, before I do that before I do that, let me see if I can pull up, um, I got my tablet real quick. Let me see if I can make match with my tablet and go ahead real quick. Oh, maybe I should put the parking brake on. Okay. Let me see. Let me go this way. Then we go this way. Come on. Then we go this way. Type YouTube. Okay, 
Let's do a search. We're gonna search for S A M. Okay, I got two Sam XLTs. The one with the flag or the one with the car? Damn, that's fast. Cool, though. What state is this in? It's cool though. This definitely is cool. <laughs> I thought she was going to crash into that car. You know what? I was so busy watching the time lap, I didn't even pay attention to the bottom. Okay, cool. I know what I'm, as a matter of fact, I know what I can do with this, too. I know what I can do with it. I'm a sh I know who to show it to tomorrow. I have one of my buddies that's getting, is, is starting to get into this, too. So cool. I can show it to him tomorrow at work. Man, let me go back and find it again. Come on. Piece of, come on, piece of shit. Yeah, that's why I didn't see it, because I had it at the full screen on my tablet, so I couldn't see the bottom. So on the full screen, you, you don't know the title, so it's cool.
Yeah, but that, that that's cool though. <laughs> Damn, I thought she was gonna hit that car again. It seems like every time you turn around that little black car, there's always one or two that you wind up in the front. They go that truck passing you right now. Well, they not gonna pass me. Yep. Yes, I'm gonna pass you. Uh, no, you're not. Yep, the tanker. Yep. Nope. I'm gonna pass you. Okay. Is that hay? Okay, cool. I see it. Hey, Coco, you still there? Okay, cool. All right, we are in Germany now. Yes, indeed. Hey, cool. I hear you, bub. Hey, thanks for hanging out, man. Hey, I'm going to, I got something that I'm going to do with that, um, that time. I, I think I'm going to show it to my students tomorrow, if it's all right with you. I'm going to go ahead and let my students check it out. I get, I get a chance to put it on the board. They're going to ask me, well, what did you do last night? I'm going to say, well, I went to, 
I went for a ride. Keep right. I'm gonna set them up. Right. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna let them check it out. They'll. I, I know they'll think it's fun. So cool. They'll. They'll have a lot of fun looking at it. Turn right. It's hard for them to believe that I stream, so that's even funnier for them. Oh. But hey, hey, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you when I, when I see you. Hey, thanks for hanging out, man. Talk to you later, bubba. Go to sleep, man. Get you some sleep.
I'm loving it. Yeah. Still got now we know we we pulling in the Munich. This is cool. Uh, a little bit of European truck simulator. That's okay. I know it's supposed to be American truck simulator. It's cool. How about we doing a little bit of both? Plus, we also had a little bit of flight simulator, too. That's how we got here. We got the cargo that got here. The cargo got here by that. So it's, once again, cool. Well, we're going to check this out from Windows. Haven't seen what a European crash looks like. So let's see what that crash looks like. Now, every once in a while, you got to have a little bit of fun, go through stuff. stretch of highway is down. Oh. Oops. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on one second. Flaming Hot Cheetos. She knows I love the Flaming Hot and Flames. This time they got, she got me some Cheetos. And she didn't give me the one, the fried ones, she got me the puffy ones. The bad boys are good. So if you hear me smacking and popping, just cut the volume down. Uh, 
You like spicy food? These Cheetos are going through the most crash. These Cheetos will do it for you. They will attach some hope before it's crashing in. in a minute. I'll probably learn my lesson not to be doing going to accidents. But you gotta figure that they want you to see these accidents. Could have not. They could have just blocked off the road with a cone or something. Like I was saying, if they didn't want you to view those little things, they could have just blocked stuff off with a cone. But they know people are going to go down there and be nosy and check it. So that's what we did. We had a case of being nosy. That's the reason why I picked um, the uh, chump. So. Hey, hey, Coco. Okay, who else we got out here? Hey, you got to get up early. You got to do what you got to do. Thank you very much for hanging out. I really appreciate you hanging out. Hey, thank you. Love you. Go ahead. Go to sleep. Don't worry about it. I got this. You know, I got this. I'm cool. So, hey, but thanks again. See you tomorrow. Here you go. Welcome to Old Stars 57 Gaming. Blue Dog Logistics Global Transportation. You're probably looking at the screen right now trying to figure out what has happened. This does not look like American Truck Simulator. That's because American Truck Simulator on this stream has merged with European Truck Simulator. And we will be here for probably in Europe and a little bit a little bit longer because we got the DHL contract. And what we mean by the DHL contract, we're flying, we're driving DHL colors. And we got a chance the opportunity, got hired by DHL to come to Europe and drive for them as um, part of these here hands across the water thing. So we got the opportunity to come over here to Europe, so we're driving over here, but then We'll be going back to the States and a little bit after a couple more loads. But what we're doing was, wow, they got this stuff all over the place. What we wanted to do was just try something a little bit different because it would be so unique if American Truck Simulator and European Truck Simulator would have a way to be able to merge and you could be able to go from one to the other. That would be so cool. But 
it hasn't happened yet, but we have a thing called the transition. And the transition, we use American Truck Simulator, we use Flight Simulator, and we use European Truck Simulator. And if you're around for the transition, you'll see it. But if not, we do we do DHL. We're going to start doing DHL every Wednesday. And if you look at my um, about, you'll see that I try to keep a calendar. And we're going to do, we're going to keep a calendar of what we're going to do. And we're driving a whole bunch of trailers. We like to do livestock. We do um, tow cars. Um, we do vehicle transports. There's a lot of things that we do and, uh, here at Blue Dog Logistics. Make sure that you go ahead and hit that follow or that subscribe or however you do it depending on the platform that you're coming from, that you're viewing me from. Because what that does is it makes you, it keeps you on the list and being part of the Legacy uh, 100. Because my first 100 followers, I'm working on trying to put together some type of package, something fun, uh, something that I can invite you all to be able to see and do. And that's the reason why you want to get your name inside that marquee. Yeah, okay, cool. right and then turn right Where it ends.
careful. Yeah, we doing real good. So, hey, it's, it's hanging in there. So, hey, thank y'all for showing up. Thank you for hanging in there. Like I said before, you got, excuse me, every once in a while, because I'm going to snack snack. Right now, I'm eating uh, Flaming Hot Cheetos. Not the fried ones, the puffy ones. So, I'll try not to chew in front of you. Not... Wait, got one more in the bag. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, so good. Mm. Hold on, let me take a step outside. See what the rest of the world is doing. Let's see who is. Wow. Show less. There's a whole lot of people on so I see. Thanks for that. Okay, seven, four, and two. Let's see if we go back.
All right, let's go ahead and get this here started. We're back. Don't even worry about it. It happens sometimes, but we are back. Okay, we just got this. We're doing this. We're doing this, and we're doing that. Okay, cool. We're here, we're doing that. Yeah, we are there, right? Yeah, we are there. Okay, cool. Take a look at the market real quick.
time to get the job done. Turn left. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Yeah, yeah, yes, okay. Everything will be all right. Keep right and then exit. Ready to turn left. Turn left and then turn left. Turn left. We are finished. Wow. I didn't see that coming.
Find a new route. Okay, let's find a new route. Turn left. Turn right.
time to go back home. Yes, indeed. <laughs> oh, yeah, boy. We back in the States. There we go. We are back. Back to home where we should be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we're going to do. See if they got anything for us to ride with.
same as I go. short one, 49, let's see, oh, that's not 49,000, I'm sorry, Yes, indeed.
yeah, we're going to do is we just got back from Europe. We're going to go ahead and park the truck and do some other stuff and see what we got going on. Okay, but hey, this is a four-hour one, so we've been out here for a little while. We enjoyed ourselves, and we'll probably catch up to you later on, okay? Hey, but hey, this is Osiris57. want to let you know thanks a lot, hey, and it's been a lot of fun, and we'll be on to my road. So I will see y'all tomorrow, okay? So make sure you have yourself a good time. Make sure you enjoy yourself. And this is also at 57, so hey, I'll see you. Let's go ahead on and get our stuff ready. Make sure we got the vehicle ready. Cut the lights off. Okay, make sure we got it locked up. Let's see what we can do to get to next.